I am. No longer think that my life or the life of my species, my sex or my race or whatever is the most important thing on this whole world. Be aware that if humans disappear from this planet, so-called humans, the naked ape that called himself Homo sapiens, so ironically, what means the wise, the wise man, Be aware that if the pollinators like these butterflies disappear, the whole ecosystem collapses. We will not grow food anymore. If the phytoplankton, tiny green animals, disappear, we have no we have no oxygen anymore. We have only a small amount of oxygen because the seas are responsible for something like seven percent of all the oxygen on Earth. Rainforest, something like uh, ten, uh, something like twenty to uh, thirty times, uh, forty percent. So why, if, if the naked ape is beer, anything become better? So why do people think the rust is special? We are the exact opposite of being special. We take so much from the other animals. So much from the earth and giving absolute nothing back. I'm embarrassed. I'm very embarrassed. To ever call myself and being proud to call myself a member of this geo of this um, Homo sapiens or so I like to call them. Homo reticulus or Homo neutus. Neutus, the naked ape. We are not so bright, smart people the way we now act. Destroying our rainforests. 65% is directly cattle rancing. Uh, in total, something like 51% of all the rainforest is cut for animal slavery or husbandry, just like this. Political correct widows want to avoid because the media industry finds it offensive if you call it slavery, when it is in reality slavery. You not can deny that. If animals are not slaves, what there are? What then? What there are? Yes. If they are not slaves, they are free. Then they are not put in small cages when they not can even do their natural behavior. If they are not slaves, they can walk around freely. If they are not slaves, then uh, people will not to assault people stealing them uh, from farms. It are not seen like property in the same regard slaves were seen as property. In the time of slavery in America, people like um, Henry, in the time of slavery, people like Harriet uh, Tumpman from the Underground Railroad were also seen like uh, thieves. There are also bounties for uh, g giving her to the authorities because he was um, doing illegal things like uh, freeing uh, think, um, um, slaves to the states where not slavery was. He was one bounty of 4,000 uh, 40,000 uh, dollars on her head and sometimes some of the slave liberationists have um, one bounty of two thousand uh, dollars on their head only because they freed blacks from the evil bureaucracy of the slavery. 
In the same way, uh, animal rights activists are harassed by the psychopaths of the government who, only t who believe law is equal to justice. Are we going to play this game over and over again? Are we going to play insane? So sh Einstein wants to say... I wasn't, I wasn't very sure in that time, most of the time was called vegan because the terminology vegan was not was there not on the time. Uh, but he say once the definition of insanity is doing something over and over again and expecting a different result. People awaken. Laws are just a suggestion. There are not one indicator of being right. So I explained. People like Harriet um, Tumpman were harassed by the government only for freeing slaves. Be not such fool, people. Be not a fool. When come the day that we finally understand that no living being on this planet, no sentient living being, deserve to be commodified, enslaved, exploited, and turned to profit for some rich, elitist, self-righteous motherfucker who believe the whole world belongs to humans, and when more specific to a small elite group of humans. If people truly want to stop terrorism, they have to uh, put their flesh out of the uh, in the trash uh, out of the fridge and support the people like the elf, the liberate elf, um, the elf, the animal liberation front, and go vegan because the most biggest form of terror is not. In, in countries like uh, Africa, it's not in countries like uh, China. The most biggest cost of murdering of sentient beings is happen in countries like America. America, the land that killed. For uh, I killed um, some ten billion innocent living beings for flesh, for a burger, for an addiction of greed, selfishness, gluttony. Not because we need it, because people are brainwashed to believe they like the taste. Because if you think about it, nobody likes the taste of meat. They only like the way it be made. They like the spices, they like the salt, they like the, the peppers, they like anything that has come with it. They like the onions also, the garlic. They like the peppers. But nobody likes a dead animal on the railroad. If they see a uh, dead animal carcass on the road, most of them think they not, oh, delicious, I want to eat that. Only creeps or weirdos. Maybe Ted, Ted, Ted Bundy thinks that is a good idea. Or people like um, that motherfucker uh, Ted Newton. How is an legal psychopath? And mass murderer of far more important ec uh, ecological and morally than him. He's completely morally bankrupt. You know, I have an IQ for something like 140. Give that my right 
according to your logic, to kill people like Ted Newton? If you say that we have the right to kill animals because they are less intelligent than the majority of us. By that logic, yeah, I have the right to kill people like Ted Newton. And I'll do it. I have now the attention to send one hitman. Well, according to the logic of many of you, I have the right to do that. All oh, your arguments are so weak, so lazy, and so evil. No viral. Stop being such an arrogant, elitist cunt. Self righteousness and arrogance will not make this world to a better place, you nasty, overprivileged. Fuck girls and fuck boys.